What's good, Homo Squad? It's your boy, Homo Ziggy. We back here with another reaction. And as you see behind me with the thumbnail, we got JID with 30 freestyle. Now, hey, I said for this new year, hold on. First things first. Yeah, you know, I already had to lock that door for a certain someone and you know who that is but I said for the new year I wanted to start coming make this channel be more of like in a way some good mainstream songs and such or underground songs no matter which one cuz I like I said I always gonna show love to my nerdcore side of course that's my channel my, you can say my channel literally blew up in a way because of that so I always gonna give my love to the nerdcore but I always want to come back to like my mainstream music and such cuz I don't want to always give it shit about how all mainstream music is trash and such not all of them just the ones that be popping out to be basically categorized, categorized as main like popular and such when nine times out of ten it be trash so I'm going so I'm making sure whenever it comes to my channel I'm putting the ones that are fire like the JIDs and such. So we better check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get in the video. Conductor Crystal. Let's just be quiet. One second, please. We can grab it, dog. Everything real vanilla. Everything moving. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Really? Holding. Look at me, dog. Uh, no. Niggas know I ain't the one to sleep on. I'm under pressure, gotta sleep with the heat. An extra clip beside the dresser like I'm Pac, paranoid niggas pop. An extra clip beside the dresser like I'm Pac, and A. It's so, you know what's so crazy about this? It's just so crazy that over the years and such where if you would have done something like that, it would be such a YouTuber thing. Now you got mainstream artists like J.I.D. doing this shit with the whole visuals like on the screen and such. Like the actual lyric on the screen and such, and others too. Hey, it's just so crazy that they starting to realize the YouTubers and such, like reactors and so and such, are gonna start wanting to listen listen to what the heck you actually trying to say. Look at me, like I'm pop paranoid niggas smoking puffin pop Side the dresser like I'm pop paranoid niggas puffin pop puffin out your chest what stop we ain't stupid we ain't stun you and nothing you doing I'm the intruder the pursuer the persuader the shooter I display a wide array of different styles my latest none greater I graduated from furious man I'm just aggravated say congratulations everybody I can activate the imagine they have first let bear bonds from out the bag and cages pre perform Bro, this what and look, this is what we meet. It's basically like this. This is what the new, how the new trend of rap is now. Cause new trend of hip hop. Cause let's be honest, not everybody, not all the time you gotta be hard in such 24/7. Now we always gonna want the li the hard lyrics bars, the gangster bars, whatever, right? Cool. But all I'm saying is right that nowadays. You don't always get. It's basically like this. To quote Moray on a, like an interview he did way back, where everybody like when you have a gun, everybody wanna act like they the gun, nigga. You is not the gun. You just the holder of the gun. Stop trying to act like you is the gun and trying to pop on people. Basically, in how I look at it, where nigga, ain't nothing wrong with you trying to show a little personality wise, cause at the end of the day more people are gonna if you really think about it more people are gonna like try to gravitate to you more often rather than just for your music but for actually like your personality like your character and such so ain't nothing wrong with showing a little personality in your songs nowadays that's all I look at run my back run my 
run, run. What he said, run my back. Run my bath, rub my back, baby. Run my bath, rub, run my, rub my back, baby. They've been sack chasing, mm, saying that I, my back is sore from carrying all these money and such. Okay. If all these rats racing, I'm coming in last place. Snakes in the grass. Oh. All these rats racing, I'm coming in last place. Cause nah, nigga. Cause you know how them rats love to run real quick to the. And hey, I've said it before. If you if you haven't, go check out my reaction to where I reacted to your boy Sponge with stitches. If anyhow you was part of something and you bitched out in the last moment, you was a rat. You a snitch. And I, last place. Turn your favorite rapper into an ashes in an ashes tray. Damn. And you know what's the craziest thing is? In a way, that's not like a saying that you're smoking smoking somebody and such. At least he's not putting like your name in such and such. He's just saying smoking your favorite rapper. And that could mean a whole lot of things, like smoking and such, but also smoking that like with the pen and such. So hey, in a way. That's the type of lines that don't sound like you're actually gonna kill somebody and such and put them in a song for entertainment. I'm an athlete, turn your favorite rapper to the okay. ashes in the ashes. That's just straight. Ash tray, ash Louis, ash Izzy, ash Quick, and ash Dre, ask around the A, ask the mass on the plantation, and ask the magistrate. Who the biggest mm. baddest in the land is about to masturbate with both hands smacking it across your face. Hey, Drop hey yo, <laughs> what? <laughs> Uh uh, you do that, you getting a right hook for me. Nah, you masturbating, then you uh uh, get out of here. in the land is about to masturbate with both hands, smack it across your face. Drop a tape before the album, most of you lost taste. But I'm sniffing like a hound for a center of lost grace. Trying to figure out if I'm really him or a fraud fake. He gonna find a way, either in the game or God's gates. Put your guard up. He gonna find out if he's, hold up. But that that's crazy. I'm sniffing like a hound of scent of the lost greats. Put your put your guard up or your rod up. It's time to play. Damn. Either in the game or God's gates. Put your guard up or guard pick up, your rod up. It's rod time to play. Hit your squad up. We beat you all up and take your ball, bro. All tough mm. behind the screen, but softer than my broad butt. Raw cup. All tough behind the screen, but softer than my broads, but nigga. That's a good way of saying, nigga. You so, and trust me, you know how your girls but be so. I, hey, to me, all I be saying. With the whole people, with whole women want to take about these damn B, basically women want to take BBLs and such. What's wrong with the naturals? Like, god damn. It's basically like this. This is how I look at it. For when it comes to the female body now, don't hear, hear me out when I say this. And look it, I don't want nobody said about how, oh, you sexualizing, mother sucker. Y'all need to tell me y'all, look, point is, when it comes down to it, it's one thing if you want to look I'm not trying to convince you of not trying to do what you want to do you're a grown person you can do what you want to do I'm just telling you learn to just know what the consequences is when you're doing that but what I am saying is what happened to the all naturals you're rarely hearing of any all naturals out there anymore like damn and hey ain't nothing wrong with the all natural man Put your guard up or pick your rod up. That's all I'm saying. Hit your squad up, we beat you all up and take your ball, bro. All up behind the screen, but softer than my broad. My broad's butt. Behind the scene, and all the things I say, I mean, and all the things I mean, I say, respond to beat. See who play. See who I'm the master, I'm the dragon and the teacher, and I carry Christ's passion. Let it blast through the speakers, let my black ass show when I'm on the stage. Drop beneath down, very unethical when they come to public speaking. I probably been smoking and drinking, saying just what the fuck I've been thinking. Hold you. Mm. Just let him off the leash and now he aiming for your head Put the old Damn. people, children, and women in the bed Heard you mm. walking around with the infrared Brother went off the head Don't be scared, we could save him and talk him back off the 
ledge. If it's beef eating flesh, he turn it to a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Give a mm, guys, guys, Tyrannosaurus Rex, them car, them carnivores. This nigga saying he a carnivore. You Talk him back off the ledge. If it's beef eating flesh, he turn it to a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Who you said was up next? And up now, I'm on the outside looking into the crowd like a sniper shooting bugs off your windshield wiper. My rhyme cipher like a fully loaded rhyme. My rhyme cipher like a Sorry, I can't even. Nah. And this is and the thing is with JID with I, look, I'm always saying it's JID, but then people said it's Jid. I mean Either way you say it, it's still his name. I'm gonna cause for me, I'ma just say JID. Cause that's how we that's how it was introduced at first. So it I mean either way I'ma switch it out. But this is what people always liked about Jid and such, where he can come in with this freaking the rhyme schemes, the the bars and all that, right? But one thing but one thing I've been saying throughout this entire reaction is the charisma. Where nigga, you don't always gotta have one I've said it before in videos, you don't always gotta have one emotion when you're coming into a song. You don't. Some people want to get happy. Some people can be happy. Some people can be sad. Some people can be funny and such. And especially, and like I've said before, you're an artist. It's your own. I know most of the times people want to make songs that can really talk to you and such. Like really get into what you're talking about. Like really deep stuff. But I'm just saying. Like I said, like I said before, not all the time. People are gonna want to hear all that deep stuff. Pause. Cause you you got more than one emotion in you. That's all I'm saying. And with Jid, that's why we loved him. That's why everybody keep on listening to him. Cause he can he can still rap his ass off and come with some charisma charisma in his songs. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Mm. Mm. He still like that. Like that this man was in Poland shot this. Man was in Poland when he shot this. But hey. Shout out to JID, Jid, whatever as you want to call it. But hey man, all I'm going to say is, if this, it's basically like this, I'm going to make sure I come back to more Jid, whatever, whatever this video does good or not, because like I said, for this year, I'm making sure I'm putting like the fire mainstream songs, fire mainstream rappers to me, because I don't want to just put any other main, mainstream artists out there, because it's going to feel like I'm deriding. Or trying to get the views. It's not all well trying to get views, yes, but not always about any even a rapper. But either way, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. And if you made it to the end of this reaction, comment down below. Tyrannosaurus Rex. <laughs> comment that down below and let's and let's see if you can spell that sucker. No Google. Let's see if you can spell it on your own. But either way, it's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. Stay positive. Keep the vibes up. Lego.